everyone and welcome. This is Melissa Armo with the Stock Swoosh and reviewing Facebook. This was a put. I called the 175 puts yesterday morning, actually before the open when I saw Facebook, how it was gapping. And lo and behold, I did not know about the news that was to come out yesterday. And it made the stock crash. So I called them out actually till quite a while, till the end of next week. But again, with a move like this out of the gate, you wouldn't be in it and still you would be out. Um, and again, this still could go lower, but I really think when you do a trading, you have fast money really quick like this, you get out of profit, and that's what I tell everybody, get out when you're up. So you could have bought this around two, maybe you would have paid a little bit more, but it dropped and almost got to five as far as the cost of the option where you could have sold it. So say you bought something for two and you sell it for five, what do you make? Three bucks. Now, I don't think it actually got to five. I don't think five was the high, but it got pretty close. Anyways, you're never going to get out of the low. You're never going to get um, in a short, just like you're never going to get out of the high in a long. But when you see a dramatic dive, let's go back here like this. It's pretty easy to know to get the heck out. And that is what it did. Actually, let's look at it better on the one minute here, actually. And then this is yesterday. I'm just behind. I'm be, I'm behind so many videos and so many things here right now. I'm trying to get caught up, but this was a really nice trade yesterday. I think pretty much everybody get out of it. It was kind of like the one of those ones where it'd be crazy not to get out of it. Here, I mean, look at that. And, and I was sitting here. I was like, "Woo! Where did that come from?" And there it was. So beautiful, beautiful, here it is. So this is Facebook yesterday, as you can see. Drop, drop, drop. Oh no, actually, wait a minute. No, here, here was the previous day. Where's the open? Oh no, here, here, 9.30, 6.12. Dropped, push back, look at all this. And then again, I liked it lower. I called the trade in the morning, in the pre-market. And I had no idea the news was coming out, and then it collapsed, literally. In fact, let's look at this. From 177.27 to 172.88. If I had known it was going to fall like that, I would have called the ones that expire tomorrow. Because <laughs> they would have been a heck of a lot cheaper. But still, to pay two for something and sell it for four something, that's almost 100% or 100% depending on what you paid for it, return on investment in one day and very quickly. And it basically all came into this dramatic move. So interesting enough, uh, there it is. But I will say though that I do like this lower still in, in the picture here that we're looking at right now. It rallied today slightly, but really didn't go anywhere. And again, I've been looking at this lower ever since back from here. Um, which was the gap up that failed to go higher and it never really could quite control the selling after this and that is what happened and as we know this was a really big one here that was last week this you could have done this this was beautiful yesterday and anything could happen here again in this so be watching this for the possibility of more more trades to be called in Facebook but really nice move in that there yesterday and it was fast and that's the best way to do them. But again, you know, you gotta give these things a little bit of time because you're never really sure when the sell-off is gonna happen, but it just happened the immediate day that I called it and it happened quick and fast and big, which is good. For something to drop like that, you know, $3 into the strike is, is fantastic. So you get you get it out and you book the money. When you're, when you're trading, when you're actively trading, and it just doesn't matter if you're day trading or options trading, you take it, book it, take it, book it, take it, book it, take it, book it. You know, it's, it's, that's the way you gotta do it the way you got to play it. Anyways, good luck, everyone. We'll see where Facebook goes. I'll be tracking this just to watch. Email me at Melissa, the stock swoosh.com. If you'd like more information, great job, everybody that did this. Great exit on this yesterday. Again, when you have a move like that, you got to take the profits. Tell everyone, get out when you're up. It was really easy today to watch this. I mean, yesterday to watch this and see where to exit though. Just a nice, nice sell up. And I will be continuing to watch the stock and see what it does. If you're interested in the Gap Options letter, email me at melissa at thestockswish.com.